good morning. Happy Thursday, Vlogmas Day 10. Wow, crazy. I'm in my car because I'm making myself finally go to the post office and get this stuff mailed out because it's already going to be late, I think. So I thought I would just bring you guys along. I'm by myself. My kids didn't want to come with me. Um, you can hear in my voice, I have a little bit of nasally, um, but not too bad. I woke up feeling a lot better today, more energized, uh, refreshed, and all of that. So, um, like I said, I do have a little bit of, you know, where my nose is a little bit. But other than that, I'm feeling great. I'm thankful that it's getting better and not worse. Um, so yeah, today hopefully is a fun vlog day. I'm gonna do today and tomorrow. Um, and then I have Friday favorites and fails, so I may include that in the Friday Vlogmas. And what I'm thinking this Friday, since I told you guys I wanted to change it up a little bit, I think I'm going to um, do my face with some of the makeup that I've been loving. Now this week, honestly, I haven't really put on any makeup because I wasn't feeling 100% good. But I'll use some of my favorites, maybe from past videos and stuff like that that you guys have not seen me seen me use. So yeah, um, I'm gonna go ahead and head to the post office. I'm gonna bring you guys along and anything else I decide to do. I may decide to go by Target, I don't know. See how I feel, I don't wanna have a lot of interaction with people because I don't know, you know, what I have or anything. But I'll be back. I just wanted to say hello and I hope you guys are having a great day. I'll see you later, friends. Okay, friends, leaving the post office now. I'm heading to. I'm so glad I finally got that done. And the post office in my town, which is Yukon, was not bad at all. I'm glad I came here because the one in the city that I was going to, which is not too far from my house, um, but it was so packed. Like the line was all the way to the back. So the fact that I had my stuff packaged and ready to go was great. Um, so Sonic today is having 50 cents corn dogs, so I thought I would pick some up for me and my kids and also get me a cranberry limeade because I'm definitely feeling something other than water and hot tea. Um, that's all I've been drinking. Hi guys, so I'm in my closet and I need to do some organizing and some putting away of some clothes and stuff and it's just a hot mess down here on the floor and it's really been irritating me and aggravating me. Um, but yeah, I just thought I would organize in here and that I'd bring you guys along. There's some Christmas gifts in here I need to put away and just set aside and then tons of shoes I need to go put away too. So yeah, I'm just going to do that.
manage all these boxes here. These are shoes that I need to find a place for. I don't have room for them. It's just ridiculous. I have way too many shoes. That is um, a container I got at Dollar Tree. It has like um, extras like Q-tips and face wipes and things like that I keep in here. And then these are some gifts right here. I just have them right here in the forefront, but I got all that situated under there. There's some of my purses. Got my husband's side situated. Definitely need a vacuum in here. But I wanted to show you guys real quick. I just have way too much stuff, you guys. Um, and please, this is no means, by no means me bragging about anything I have. I just have way, way too much stuff and definitely gonna be working on getting rid of a lot of it. So anyways, I wanted to show you guys real quick. I have an Alex drawer in my closet. It's the nine drawer, I believe. I wanted to show you how I store. So I have all of these bracelets that I don't even wear anymore um, in here in these little bags here. Um, this is my Pandora bracelet my husband got me for my anniversary two years ago. And you could see how it looks. It's just in here. Um, it looks so old and tarnished. All of them are rose gold. Um, he paid a lot of money for this. And it just, the quality of it, you have to constantly be shining it, shining it like cleaning it, you know, with the cloth and everything. I just think it's a waste. Um, so I would never recommend anything from Pandora um, because I also have a ring. He got me to go with this and it does the same thing. We constantly, you could see how dull and how yucky it is. I barely wear it. And it's just so, on camera it's not looking that bad, but in person it's really bad. Um, it just doesn't stay put the way it's supposed to or stay shiny the way it's supposed to these are just my watches uh, my sunglasses I have all in here um, it's a little full at the moment because I got a few new sunglasses this summer my husband's watches I keep in here these little containers are just from the Dollar Tree I don't know if you guys remember these bracelets back in the day the charm bracelets I still have mine when this was real big in the early 2000s um, where you were getting these and I don't know that you could find them anymore as far as the charms for them maybe I'm not sure but I still have mine I kept them right there so that's what I have in that drawer and then the third drawer I just have backup stuff these were given to me um, they're just some um, St. Patrick earrings I just thought they were cute um, this is a jewelry container underneath here with more jewelry that I don't really reach for and wear so why I have it I don't know but yeah so there's that right there definitely going to be doing going through like I said and getting rid of a lot of this there's no sense in having it if I'm not going to use it sorry guys my nose is um I keep sneezing today so these are just empty jars of things I finished. I just keep the jars so I can clean them out and use them for something else later. Um, this is one of those clear acrylics I got at TJ Maxx or Marshalls. These are my little brushes, um, you know, that you put on top of the brushes and stuff, a backup. Uh, this is an eyelash curler, a sharpener. These are all my perfume, roll-on perfumes and sampled perfumes here. These are some uh, small, like, moisturizers and things that I have, cleansers for travel or anything like that for backup. Things I got in boxes, same here. And then these are just extra lip scrubs, lip balms, and things like that in that back one. So that's how I keep that drawer. This is where I keep little hair things right there. Um, those are my kids' teeth when they were little few of them um and then so i have those that i got at the dollar tree some hair products hand sanitizer more hair scrunchies mostly from the dollar tree i keep and then hair things in here this is my hair drawer for my like straightening iron and bulge iron and all of that 
my daughter comes in here and she gets in my stuff because she doesn't put it back properly. So then I have this issue where I cannot close it. So this is where I keep my dry blow dryer, my um, flat iron, my wave waver, or not waver, curling rod and all of that in that drawer. Here is where I keep all of my lashes that are currently my own lashes. Uh, the ones that I have for myself. So I have all of these Ioni ones from the Dollar Tree. Glam Light, Ioni. I got these uh, from Ulta when I worked there. The Velour Lashes. Shop Miss A, Glam Light. Some from, um, that I got from, there's a pair from Marshalls. Some of these I got when I was in the Lashy Box. This is from uh, BoxyCharm right here. Um, these are from the Dollar Tree. These are from Lashy Box when I was getting the subscription. Some time back, I got some Ardell's. Um, I think, I can't remember. These are Kiss Lashes. Those are one of my favorites. Some more from when I was with Lashy Box that I have yet to try. All of these actually are from Lashy Box and I have yet to try those. And then in this drawer, I just have all of my nail polishes. That is currently all of them I have. I did get rid of some. I know this is excessive still, but I did get rid of some. Uh, and then I have just some nail filers and things like that. And then down here, got some press on nails and some other like nail essentials and all of that. Some press on nails here that I got at the Dollar Tree. Have yet to try them. But yeah, that's what I store in there. Then on top, I just have my white container with backup makeup, some jewelry stuff here. This is where I house my backup makeup. So I have some concealers and primers and um, my foundations actually. They're not backups, they're just where I keep them. Other products as well. My mom gave me this one year for my birthday, I believe, or for Christmas. Can't remember, it's been a while. So I just store backups there or my extra foundations that I can't fit out here. So yeah guys, that's pretty much it for the closet for now. I'll be back a little bit later. Hi friends, happy Friday. So I just got off the shower. Today was my hair washing day and I got a surprise that I'm gonna share with you guys. Um, today is Vlogmas day 11, crazy. Um, but I'm gonna go make myself some coffee. I haven't had coffee all week, um, maybe one time, but I didn't finish it. So I'm gonna try some coffee. I feel great. I just have like, um, I wouldn't say congestion in my nose. It's almost like um, I have like toilet paper stuck in my nose and I can breathe and everything through it just fine. It just feels very, smells like linty, if that's a way to explain it. But I just wanted to come on here, say hello, happy Friday, um, and share my surprise. It's sitting right there on there. So yeah, I'll be back and I'll share that with you guys here shortly. Okay friends, so I'm still, my hair's still not dry or put up, but I got this in the mail, the Glam Light Foodie Box. Super excited. So I thought, why not just come on here, make it fun, and share this with you guys. So today's supposed to be my Friday favorites and fails. And honestly, I'm, I mean, I'm feeling a lot better, but I'm just not in the mood to wear makeup today. At this moment, I may change my mind later. You can hear a little bit of congestion in my nose. I can breathe just fine. I can smell everything. It's just like um, in my nose, I feel like there's lint or tissue or I don't know how to explain that. But anyways, I thought I would just come up on here and share this with you guys. I seen Dorisa uh, Ray, she got her box and she filmed a try on with it yesterday and I wanted to do something like that, which I may still do later. But right now I'm just gonna share with you what came in the box. I'm sure you're familiar, most of you. Box, look how cute. And it's packaged and wrapped really, really nicely. And I'm just sitting on my chair doing this. Um, So it did come with a little card. It says, Dear Foodie, on behalf of the Glam Light family, we want to wish you the sweetest Merry Christmas ever. Get into the holiday spirit with all of your favorite festive treats. With love, Giselle and team. 
and it has a coupon code right there for 15% off. That is what it looks like. Very cute. So the that right there. The first thing I see is the cookies and milk. I believe this is the highlighter. And um, I did see Teresa try this and it's so beautiful. I don't want to open it because I don't know that I'm going to keep it because um, it does look like it might be too dark for my skin tone um, and I'm very fair, a lot fairer than Dorisa is so yeah I think I'm going to set that aside for now. These are the gingerbread lashes, very cute, I love the packaging. I do love lashes. So this will probably be my third pair I think I have from Glamlight, maybe second, can't recall. Came with this really cute brush set, um, the Candyland Trio, right there. Very cute. I believe, yes, this is eggnog lip gloss. That is what that one looks like. I'm just gonna set the box down. Oh, that's a beautiful, beautiful color. It's like a nudie pink, very pretty. I know for sure I'm gonna keep this. Sorry about the sniffling. It smells like cupcakes. And it has a little mirror on the other side. I don't really want to be over all of this that's going on so I can try this stuff with you guys. I would have loved to open it and try it. But unfortunately, due to whatever's going on in my system, yeah, I just thought I'd share this with you guys here on the vlog. This is the Pecan Pie. Uh, it's another lip gloss. It's in a different packaging. Ooh. It's a very pretty color. Definitely doesn't look like a pecan pie color to me. Oh, it smells so good. It's like a really pretty mauvey pink. Very, very nice. Excited about that. Velvet liquid lipstick, I believe. Wow, that's a beautiful color. Look at that. Beautiful red right there. Okay, and then the last thing that I'm super excited about, which I thought was going to be a lot smaller, like the box and everything, is the pie palette right there. It's in a cute pie box. It is sealed completely. I love Glam Light's concept and if you guys are not aware I seen on their Instagram last night that she's coming out with another Christmas holiday box as chocolate lovers or something like that. But that is what it looks like. And you open it up. Look at that. It's so cute. She just has the cutest styles and ideas. I mean, my goodness. I mean, if this is not... It, and this is like a foamy packaging. Or like spongy, I guess you would say. Very, very cute. Is what that looks like right there you guys look how beautiful beautiful I'm so excited got that blush in the middle very pigmented look at that blush that's one little swipe from that blush in the middle cherry pie um let's see wow look at that that is blackberry right there on my finger, barely even dabbed it in there. 
so excited to use this. And then let's do apple pie. Look at that. Wow. So yeah, that's everything I got in the box. Definitely be on the lookout. I'm gonna be doing a video for this for sure. Like I said, I wanted to do it today, but I'm just not feeling it at the moment and I apologize guys. But you'll see a video coming very, very soon on that. is going to hear me say, it's so cute. He teases me all the time. Okay, but that is everything. So I'm going to go dry my hair. That's everything I got in here. I just thought I would share that quickly with you guys. Uh, this is Thursday and Friday's vlog and Thursday's is already super long. So I may end it here and then just go ahead and film my Friday favorites and fails what I wanted to do and just get myself out of this slump and put some makeup on. Uh, I just don't have to keep wiping my nose off. So we shall see. But um, Glamlight is one of my favorite brands. You guys know I've talked about them on my channel many times. So yeah guys, I just wanted to share that with you guys. I'm super excited to have it. I will be back here shortly. Hi friends, so I just thought I would come on here real quick and just end today's vlog Friday. I'm I'm trying really hard to be productive and, and I was gonna put makeup on and I'm just not feeling it at all. And I do feel a lot better, I just do not feel like doing it. So it's five o'clock Friday. I'm probably not gonna do anything more interesting tonight. Um, so I'm going to end it here. I apologize. I know this is not going to be the funnest vlog. And I was supposed to do my Friday favorites and fails, something pertaining to that. So we're just going to leave it at me opening my box from Glam White. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. So this is the end of the vlog. I will see you guys tomorrow, hopefully much better and feeling better. So I will talk to you guys later. Have a good evening and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.